Hi, everyone. Happy Friday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Immaculate Football. Just dropped today. Brand new release. Six box picker team five coming at you. Big thanks to all of these wonderful people here spending a bit of your Friday night with us. I appreciate that. You guys have a lot of entertainment options, and I'm glad you're choosing us for a little bit at least. Thank you. There's Alex with Last Bot Mojo, Kansas City Chiefs. There's everybody else. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. Here's the fresh case right here. All right, let's pop this baby open and let's see what we got. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. We've got another case sold out already. We've been able to sell out all of these cases without filler, so thank you very much, everybody. Uh, let's keep that going. So this is break five. Break six is already sold out. Break seven, I think, is only a few teams away, three or four teams away, and I think break eight just got into single digits. So if we dig deep, I think we'll be able to accomplish um, the rest of those immaculate breaks without without a filler, the old-fashioned way, which would be pretty cool. All right, so you can see the boxes on the top camera right there. Good luck. How much is an immaculate case, like in boxes? I don't know, probably eight, nine, ten thousand dollars a box. Maybe twelve thousand dollars a box or something like that. So you're thinking, boy, the price I paid seems awfully low. You get the best deals at Jaspies. All right, box number one. 30 out of 60, Jerry Rice Raiders edition. Oh, Nick's giving you the real answers. All right. There's a 30 out of 60. Uh, six boxes. Six boxes in the case. You can count boxes right here. And the first box right there. How much for a spot? This was, Corey, this was a uh, pick your team break. So all the teams were different prices depending on the quantity and quality of hits that you can potentially pull. J.K. Dobbins to 49. That'll be for Nico and the Ravens. Yeah, everything's, every, everything's okay now, Ryan S. Thanks for asking. I mean, it's hard to give you an example, Heath. It could be anywhere as low as like $60 and as much as $600. So it really just depends on the team and the potential of pulls you can get out of here too. Three out of 10, Drew Locke. Looks like a piece of his helmet. I think this might be too thick for top loader. So a piece of Drew Locke's helmet going to my rivals, Denver, Kurt, with that one. Nice patch, nice autograph, 14 out of 25. Chicago Bears, Stephen Wright. Isn't there some sort of Wright Brothers anniversary lately? There's Joe Theismann. 31 out of 49, jersey and silver ink autograph, right on the eye black there, going to Derwin in the Washington football team. Nice. And we've got a Denzel Mims here. I kind of like this little squirrel design they have going on this year. 12 out of 99, Denzel Mims jersey and on-card autograph for the Jets, Mark Bissett. I think Denzel Mims is a pretty interesting cat. I think with with a decent once they build an offense, I feel like he could be a sneaky good good candidate here. There's been a couple, Ryan S. We 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 pulled a couple. But uh nothing nothing low like no nothing low numbered though. So it's not like we pulled an NFL shield Hurts. But we have seen some Jalen Hurts autographs and a one of one pigskin relic. But no ink on that one. A ball that I'm assuming he threw around for a bit. 
All right, and we haven't seen one yet, but generally we'll see a, a blockchain card or two and, may, and usually a redemption or two in a case. I mean, hopefully no redemptions, but... Zodell Beckham Jr. to 60. That'll be for the Browns. Adam. We got Thurman Thomas, Buffalo Bills. Big relic there. 33 out of 49. Oliver Soria with the Bills. Buffalo! Buffalo Gold. For those of you who know that machine. Ooh! And Micah Hyde for the Bills. One of one Nike swoosh. Look at all that's got to be game used. Look at that. Game worn used material. Ooh! Oliver Soria with the Buffalo Bills. That's nice. There you go, Oliver. Do it with me. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Buffalo! I'll save that for, for picture time. I'll set that over here. We got 67 out of 99. Cole Kmet. Bears. Stephen Wright. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle, folks. Chase, chase the train whistles. Hey, there's Jim Plunkett. Old Raider. 32 out of 50. Who's got my Raiders? That is for Jerry Bennington, who's got the silver and black. And the last one here is 14 out of 25, LaVisca Chenault Jr. Jersey and on-card autograph. That will go to Alifonso with the Jaguars. All right, that was box two. Here's box three. Bit of a shallow box here. That usually means redemption. Yeah, there's a redemption on the bottom there. We'll use that blank card to hide hits. And we've got nine out of 90. Emmett Smith Cardinal edition. I think Nick Sanders was pointing out. Is that Nick? Was that you, Nick? I think Nick was saying uh, it seems like a lot of the base cards are of the players on the team they played the least with, which I kind of like. You know, it's, a, it's interesting. So I started to notice that too. Ooh, look at that. Dallas Goddard. It's a big piece of the Eagle. That's only out of 10. So are the other nine cards, will that make the entire Eagle? That'd be pretty cool. Paul Townsend with the Fly Eagles Fly. Dwayne Haskins, 30 out of 49. Three-color patch and autograph. Derwin with the Washington football team. <laughs> 28 out of 86. Michael Pittman Jr. It's pretty nice. That is for the Blue Horseshoes. Kurt. Got a triple relic and autograph. Players collection triple relic and auto. Andre Johnson. I feel like we've seen a few Andre Johnsons in our cases. 21 out of 25. I feel like pretty underrated. I feel like we gotta we gotta look at look watch the go to YouTube, watch the highlights. That is prime. He was pretty strong. That goes to King D, and King D is a Texans fan, he remembers. Alright, uh, hey, there you go, Ryan. No worries, man. Alright, and Rookie patch autographs, gold! That goes to Daniel and Dallas. C.D. Lamb. 
You know, Jeremy, that's a good question. I don't think so. I feel like people would would be covering that up if that was the if if they if it needed to be. But I think there's something there's like a silver thing you have to scratch on those blockchain cards. So I think that's where the key is. All right. Neptune's asking, is Flawless next week? Is there a Flawless re release next week? I don't think so. Not to my knowledge. I think Transcendent was supposed to be, but they might have moved Transcendent. We haven't seen a blockchain card yet, but as soon as we see one, we can take a look. No blockchain here, so maybe if we see one here, we can take a look at that card. 40 out of 60, Joe Montana. This is Niners edition of Joe Montana. Although, I guess they should have put him in Chiefs gear, the way some of these base cards have been looking. We've got a nice big uh, patch right here. 13 out of 20, Cooper Cup. Nice one for Kurt and the Rams. There's 79 out of 99, two color patch and autograph. The Bills keep on coming. Oliver with the Bills. I don't know. They're gonna, they, they're gonna have to run out at some point. Nice Devin Singletary. I love this design too. KJ Hamler. 12, uh, 32 out of 199. Can't even read today. 32 out of 99. Silver ink autograph, two color patch for my rivals, the Broncos, Kurt Disser. Another one of those cards right here. It's Alvin Kamara. Wow. Eight out of 10. You got a piece of their logo, the Fleur de Lis right there. Neon blue against, it's almost like a metallic neon blue against the black. The eye black looks pretty sharp. That is for Michael Kuhlman with this cool hit. Pretty sharp, huh? I might want to take, want to take a picture of that. All right, we got A.J. Dillon, 60 out of 99, jersey and autograph. Rookie, patch, and auto to 99. Guess what some would consider a true RPA. All right, two more boxes to go, ladies and gents. There's a blockchain card here. So yeah, I there's really no other code on here, Jeremy. I think what, what was your question again? It was cover the part of the card with the code in the picture. Yeah, well this should never be scratched off when you're buying any, any redemption like this. That goes to the Jags, by the way. So if that code is showing, then don't buy it. It's probably been redeemed already. But when selling, there's really nothing to there's nothing to cover on this uh, on this card. Which they should do points like this too, by the way. Well, blockchain is just a digital only card. These redemptions, you get the actual card. That's the big difference. Jacksonville blockchain card going to Alifonso, by the way. 44 out of 60, Randy Moss, Vikings edition, going to David. We got Devin McCourty, Patriots. That's 20 out of 25 for Victor and the Pats. Big old patch for Josh Allen, 11 out of 25. 
like the stripes right there too. Oliver with the Bills. There you go. Imagine pulling the blockchain, Herbert thinking it's real. Well, it's pretty clear that it's blockchain. I don't think anyone's going to be fooled that it's the real thing. We got Leighton Vanderesh, 94 out of 99. And believe it or not, those blockchain cards, especially for someone like Herbert, they, they can resell for a lot of money. Yeah, for selling, as long as no one scratched that silver off of the blockchain, it'd be impossible to, to scan it'd be impossible to scan the code. But if someone is trying to sell something scratched off, don't be, be wary of that. We've got Thai Law, the long arm of the law, 19 out of 50. Silver ink on the eye black. Uh, that'll be going out to Victor once again and the Pats. These eye black autographs are pretty sharp. And back here is, there he is. Two color patch and autograph Tua Tungo Vailoa. 99 out of 99. Wow. That's Roy. Roy with the Dolphins. Bought the Dolphins straight up. Tua scoring off against Mariota next week. Not this, not this weekend, but the week after that. I think the Raiders and Dolphins are playing against each other. That's pretty awesome. There you go. All right, and the final box coming up. That's right, 99 problems, but that card ain't one. Now, I want to say we pulled a Justin Herbert autograph, but it was a shadow box autograph. I pulled a couple Joe... Burrow RPAs, right? Or at least one of the two redemptions was an RPA. I pulled a Jalen Hurts RPA. And now, and I pulled it. So I just haven't seen a Justin Herbert RPA, but we finally got the two RPA. There's a Lamar Jackson, Patrick Mahomes blockchain. Wow, dual NFL shields. I'll bet you could sell that. For, uh, for a decent amount to people who collect these blockchain cards. So that'll be a randomizer between Nico and the Ravens and um, Alex and the Chiefs. And a train whistle too. A, di a, a digital train whistle. There's Eli Manning to 60. That'll be for the Giants. That's going to go to Brian Poole. We got the standard James Conner relic to 25. That'll be for the Steelers, Michael Gallucci. Steel Curtain and the Steelers. We've got numbers. Piece of his number right there. 8 out of 25, Terry McLaurin for the Washington football team. I don't know what's what that is in the middle. A little smudge in the middle. That'll go to Derwin and the Washington football team. And we've got a Bob Lilly Super Bowl autograph for Dallas. Oh, you'll hear soon enough. Oliver, what a digital train whistle sounds like for that digital only card. That's for Daniel in Dallas. A couple more to go. We've got Darrington Evans, 28 out of 99. Rookie eye black autograph. Titans. That's for Arthur Hackett. Kevin Lesser, what's going on, man? When's the last time I've seen a Big Ben autograph out of a Panini product? Probably years. He's not too common. Maybe out of like Impeccable a couple years ago, maybe? It's not too common. Oh, then there's my boy right here, Henry Ruggs III, 22 out of 25, silver and black patch. Nice autograph. Could have used him on Thursday night, Jerry Bennington. Not necessarily on offense, but to uh, play defensive back maybe. 
That would have been nice. Maybe maybe he can play defensive back. He's fast enough. All right, and there you have it. Now, time to make one person happy, one person sad. Let's go to this blank list right here, and we're going to use some new dice right there. Lamar Jackson, Baltimore. Patrick Mahomes, Kansas City. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Five and a one. Team on top after six. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time goes to Baltimore. There you go. Baltimore, that is for Nico and the Ravens. I'm assuming that's a one of one with the digital dual NFL shields. So, a digital train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. There you go. I think everyone heard. Did everyone hear that? That goes to Baltimore. And there you go, boys and girls. One person happy, one person sad. For the sad person, we'll get him next time. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And we'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.